Hi guys, Sarah G here from Well Aloha. Thanks for joining me in my living room for a little quick workout. I've only got five minutes, busy working mum. Sometimes you've got all the excuses in the world as to why you can't squeeze in a workout, but here's a quick five minute workout so we can prove that if you absolutely can get a quick sweat on in just five minutes. So big shoulder roll, we're going to start with bicep curls. So squeeze your butt, squeeze your guts, so suck your tummy in, brace those core abdominals as you start with just biceps. So again, just note, note, don't swing the arms. Don't rock the back. Sort of trying to describe what not to do. But keep your body knees soft, abs engaged, and elbows planted firmly into the side of your body, okay? You can even do alternating curls. Or together, big shoulder roll, squeeze those shoulder blades. No harm in resetting your posture anytime you feel like it needs a reset. So biceps together or alternating. Fantastic. Drop one. Dumbbell. Hold the other nice and close to your chest. Nice wide squat. And stick your butt back. So again, it's just like sitting in a chair. If you need to check, in, check your squatting technique, just grab a chair and just have your butt lightly touch that chair to know that you're going back far enough. But also again, just to make sure those knees aren't going forward of the toes. Keep your chest up and open. You don't want your upper body sort of collapsing forward like this. You want to up and open. So 10 to 15 of each exercise before we move on. We've got five minutes, gotta keep moving. Big shoulder roll, I'm gonna to go to the floor now for push-ups and rows. So chest and back, all in the same exercise. And of course, abs. Don't forget to breathe. Don't forget to keep your abs switched on. This is also an excellent tricep exercise. Try and keep your hips they were the floor when you pick up the dumbbells. You don't want to do this. I'll show you what not to do. Again, do not do these ones. Try and keep your hips square to the floor. There you go. Bring it in. Hop up really safely and carefully. Bring your dumbbells up to your shoulders for a shoulder press and a nice big lunge. So we're dancing around, upper body, lower body, up and down, there's a reason for that. It's to burn more calories, it's to create a little bit more heat in your body, it's to shunt the blood around your body from lower to upper, from front to back. So these lunges, I'll just show you from the side angle. Reset your posture. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Keep those dumbbells up at your shoulders. Big lunge. And alternate. Keep your tummy tight. Do not lunge forward like this over your knee. Keep it in the midline. And if you want to, you can even lunge front to back. If your shoulders are getting tired, you can keep your arms just alongside your body. Still really beneficial. Nice one guys, we started with biceps. Let's go back to triceps. Once you're even on both sides. Big shoulder roll. Kick that arm out. Just put one arm on your knee to rest. Or you can use a little table if you have one. <laughs> and again, I'll show you on the other side. Just make sure that this arm isn't swinging. Make sure the shoulder isn't coming up like this. You want both shoulders parallel to the ground, just like your hips are parallel to the ground. Stick your butt out and squeeze. Suck your tummy in and slow it down. For more work in the tricep. All right, guys, last exercise. Stay with me. Feet wide again. Big squat. 
Just hold the dumbbell nice and close to your chest. Keep your chest up and open. And stick that butt back. Nice, guys. Big finish. Thanks for joining me here in my living room. You can check me out at Well Aloha Sarah G on Facebook. Or just write me a note here, and I will be sure to answer any questions you have. Thanks so much for coming along and joining me. Keep going until you drop. 10 to 15 of each exercise, but see how you go. Enjoy. Thanks for the five minutes. Aloha.